Hey there, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Tro Q Wonderful. I'm Zerfall, and I hope you're ready to race. The Red City Race is a road track with a dirt alley. If you place in the top three, you win a prize and can keep your churro coins. Ready? Good luck! Let's absolutely go. So I've done this race once, um, but without the faster acceleration. So I'm hoping this will keep us closer to the other cars. It doesn't seem to be like it. Um, oh no, yeah, we definitely fell behind way less. So we have a lower top speed, which is probably a good thing because these corners are hard. But that being said, I am not going to be... Um, trying to get these coins yet. We can race this race as many times as we want. But we need to get, I think, first place to get a stamp. Whoa! Grab an air. Yeah, being able to accelerate after this. Apparently getting a clean uh, clean race too is required. This guy is right in my butt. Okay. I think we want to be going like 70 when we get around this corner. 80 is too fast! Ugh. Dropped on the third, fourth! No. All right. Still, if we slow down a little sooner on that other corner, I think we'll be okay. And we just have to collect all the coins eventually. They said we don't have to do it all in the same uh, race, right? Okay, we gotta slow down a little bit on that one next time. Although, pretty fast to slow down by hitting the wall. Okay, speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up. Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh, not quite. Oh, but that guy didn't catch up to us this time. We stayed in second, okay. All right, this isn't so bad. Let's follow it around. The outside, cut this corner a bit. Oh, oh, we're gonna overtake him if we don't mess up too badly. Oh no! All right, I, I think we're resigned to getting a second place here, but if we take the first lap like we took the second lap next time. And actually, I don't know that you want to slow down there because. like here. No. It's it's tough. Oh, what? This dude comes back out of no... Oh, I guess I did do this lap much slower than last time. So, we got in the top three. Oh. Check out this little musical sting. I'm digging this. Check this corner. That's the worst one. <laughs> Can I skip this at all? There we go. You have to hit reverse to skip. Top three. Joined a Red City race. I think there's four stamps for that. These races. Sir Thirth, place. You place. Place Thirth. Nice. You crashed 11 times. All right. So if we crash zero times, I think you get a stamp. If you get first place, I think you get a stamp. And if you um, get all the coins, I think you get a stamp. Come again soon. But we already decided what we're doing. We are going to... I think I left here. I accidentally enter this place. Want help? Oh, shoot. Okay, we clearly didn't go to this place. The mayor. I'll take you to the mayor. Follow. Oh, shoot. I'm not, I don't want the mayor. <laughs> you just back back in. Just make all the cops go places. Want help? Path to Green Park, Red City, myself. Hit your head. You live next to Q's. Is he showing me? Nope. Oh, I haven't gone to my own house, though. You're in it. Okay. 
Let's go back to our own house for a second here, because I don't know what that does. And then we're going to take that uh, path a little further, because obviously I've missed some buildings, I guess. Oh, the old Google 13 special. Alright. Don't go in there. Is there anywhere else along here that I missed? Perhaps this? No, that's the park. Okay. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Ah, oh, tire lock. Did we go to that place? We had not. In Red City, found all home. Last place. Stamps are fun to collect. Everything gives one. Well, <laughs> thanks. Yeah, it certainly do. It's uh, serendipitous that he was the one that gave us the uh, coin. All right, so somewhere around here. It's this dirt path we need to follow to get there. Or is this the other dirt path? It's not entirely wrong. Oh no, it is entirely wrong. It's this dirt path. Tires don't fail me now. All right, Jim. Howdy there. Want to play a game? Yes. All right, listen here. Count how many cars are on my farm. I dropped some. Q coins. And if you guess right, you can keep them. Please don't hit my cows. Deal? No deal. All right, let's see. Are there any cows behind us? There are Q coins over here. I hate tire lock. Q coin. I'm just gonna go around the perimeter here and grab Q coins first, and then we'll get to counting cows. There are not that many cows in the field. Or rather, the field's not that big. Just gotta be sure not to hit anybody. Oh, that one's laying down. Are any of them walking around? Ooh. Look well, close to the Q coin there, cow. That uh, clutch idea wasn't actually very helpful. Ah, I knew there'd be another coin around here. All right, let's just work our way back and forth, okay? Okay, up towards the fence. One cow. Two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight. That one kind of didn't spawn that well. Nine. I think the answer is nine. Cow here. How many? Boo! Actually, it was eleven. I'll keep my cue corns. Try again? Yes. Okay, count carefully. The number of cows might change. And it probably will. Okay, I know where the Q coins are, though. The draw distance here. Okay, I guess I gotta pump the brakes to not have that happen. Oh, cows isn't that great. But you know what? It, 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 can we use this as a level? Okay, so there's... On this level, no cows. And then... That ridge right there... 
Let's go up to the ridge that I'm talking about. Right about here. Okay, all the cows to my left of me. One, two, three, four. Nope, three. That's a Q coin with no cow near it this time. Okay. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. Nope, that is the same cows. All right, I'm, I'm confused, confused myself. Can you go up here? It was a trick the whole time. No wonder why I got the wrong number last time. Okay. Get up this hill. There's got to be a Q coin up here. Yep. All right, we'll start from scratch here. I just want to make sure I don't hit a cow. There are surely only two cows up here. Okay. Two. Two up there, and then over here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen. Cows. How many? Not zero. Oh, could you imagine? That'd be great. Correct! The Choro Q coins found are yours. Thanks, Jim. No problem. Counted cows. Did I not get all the coins? I don't know. Um, I'll have to refer to a guide at some point to uh, make sure I get all the coin, all the stamps before we get out of here. All right. So yeah, there's there's four stamps in the race. Let's see. I'm guessing the right number of cows. Out of the whole city, there are a hundred coins scattered throughout the various races and mini games, or perhaps that's the entire game. I don't know. Yes, we got stamp five and six. I collected every coin, so we missed a coin. Ugh. Let's go count those cows again. Hey there, there are some Q coins left. Will you play? Yes. All right, I'll let you. The number of cows might have changed. That's too bad. Okay, so first we're on an adventure to find Q coins. I see that, do you know what I see? That this fence goes up. But we can't actually get up there. But that's interesting. There is a coin right up there. I'm going to hit a cow, aren't I? Okay, we made it up to here. All right. Any cows up here today? No cows, but you can see there's a freaking coin right there. There's no cows up here this time. Take this corner as tight as you can. Got it. Okay. I 
probably should have reverse out here. Because I don't want to accidentally bump any cows on my way down. If the the draw distance was a little bit sharper, we might be able to pick out how many cows there were here from up here, but not this time. Okay, up top here, before we go over the edge. I wish we could just look. There's one cow, two cows. Three cows. One, two, three cows on this level. Okay. Unless there's any over here. No, no, no cows. Okay, three cows. Oh, I just, I'm not sure here. One. Two, three. Okay, everything to this side of this cow is not a cow. Four, five. Six, seven. Eight. Nine. I think the answer is nine this time. It better damn well be. Boo, it was ten. Ugh. I hate this game. Like, I don't hate this game, I just hate this very particular game. Okay, any cows on this level? I don't think so. No cows on this lane either. Okay, let's get up here. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight. Eleven. Eleven cows. That was the safest way down without any cow. Eleven cows. Correct. There. Jeez. That took a lot longer than I wanted it to. Got all cow coins. All right, let's just check our notebook here. We're missing stamp three. I wonder what that is. Kind of cows got the coins, and then those are the races. Let me see if I can find what stamp three is very quickly. I'm not seeing stamp three in this list here. This is making me feel better about it. I think it's forgetting something that we can't get yet because we need to come back. So, let's real quick get a move on. Let's try just to have a clean race. And then, depending on how much time we got left in the video, we'll um, try to have a coin pull race. We gotta go to queues, it's just this way.
Look at how much gas I'm saving. Don't hit me, bro. I could have just said, let's go to Q's. <laughs> it doesn't matter if you're going to smash as long as you hit the door first. Hey, what's up? Race. Red City Race is a road track with a dirt alley. You place in the top. Let's aim for Firth. Good luck. I think that's just the Japanese character and they didn't replace it because uh, maybe it's the same Japanese character no matter what. All right, we're aiming not to crash at all and to also uh, come in the top three. I don't know if we have to stick to the outside on this then, just to not hit these people. And if we get a sizable enough lead, I guess we can start getting coins on the way around the race. Track. Alright. Oh, oh, oh. Don't, don't hit me, bro. Oh, that counts as a hit, I bet. Okay, let's focus on the coin. Nope. Okay. What's that, like three hits? Can I just restart? You're retired? Sorry. Don't be sorry. I don't have to work another day in my life. This is tough. If we don't get it by the end of this video, we will be just ignoring it for now and coming back when we have a slightly better perk. I keep thinking I can use the analog for this. That would make this so much better. Like getting that coin without crashing? Not gonna happen. But like, I don't know, we don't have to go over 130 here. Well, let's just stay safe. Like we don't wanna crash on our way down here. We. N Oh, I don't know if that's going to count or not. Oh! Okay, this we can really open up on. get through this with just one, I'll accept it as a good try, but we might as well, I'm just curious exactly when we have to start braking, like if I just slam the brakes here, that's way too early. Oh man, this guy's hitting me from behind. He's ruined me! Definitely can just open it up there. Can we take this turn? We're experimenting now. Can we take this turn at like full speed? No, we have to let off the gas, but we can get right back on it again there. Around 100 here isn't so bad, but we gotta slow down to like 80 here. Yeah, okay. Then you can just open her back up. And then I think at the end of this, you just slam the brakes. Still hit, okay. You gotta take that corner better. We only got fifth. But that was still faster. And we didn't hit very much on it, so that's actually what we wanna do. Uh, let's just give it another go. We have to get in the top for them to even tell us how many times we hit. I don't know if there's like a ideal launch window there, like you know in Mario Kart, 
is go after three things. There was no mention of it in the little bit that I have read ahead about this game. That better not count as crashing. Because that jerk drove into me, not the other way around. Everyone there just taps the brake a tiny bit right at the end, but I guess maybe they're all going slower than me. Alright, so we got up to fifth so far. And now we know we can just open her up. That's where we make back our time. We're actually slower coming out of that than when we took it a little easier. Okay. Come on, don't hit me into the wall. Hey, people ramming you from behind better not count as not being clean in the race. Okay, we have fourth here now. Uh, this might be our one of our fastest laps ever, actually. Okay. So we just got to get ahead of this guy by the end of the thing and keep it, right? I don't care too much about passing this guy, but it wouldn't be a bad thing to do. I think we're coming out of this a little bit faster. It's real close behind us, though. No! And he's passing us, too! Because when you don't bump, you, you lose so much speed when you bump. I wish they would tell us how many times we hit there, because I think it should only be one, but I don't know if it counts. What a shame. Cheer up. Ah. I gotta try it one more time. We're going a little bit longer than I was planning on doing for these videos, sticking around 25 minutes, but if we get it, it'll be worth it. And if we don't, next time we're going to go on an adventure. I don't know if not spinning out uh, was actually faster to accelerate or not. But no one else was spinning out, so let's assume that this was a better way to start. I think 53 is maybe what we were expecting to get on this lap, so if it's a little bit better than that. I shouldn't have I shouldn't have counter steered. Okay. That was an early enough crap out that I think we did gain more speed there, because normally that corner is not a problem at all. And I thought I was turning a little too hard, so I, I counter steered and it sent me right into the wall. Nope. I, 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 okay, we're going about 70 when we hit the, the line there. That'll be our judge for next time we do something like that. Although our judge should be, I think we were actually further up the racers by here. We were going, we were definitely going like 150 instead. Oh, look at that. We're coming out of that corner way faster. We got to slow down now, though. Yeah, you want to be going like 80 in here. Don't bump me into a wall. What are you doing? What are you doing to me? Okay, yeah, that doesn't work. Okay. I, I'm I'm addicted now. Okay, so we we're going about 70 when we hit it without the spin out. Let's see with, with the spin out. Let's see what we do here. And then if that's good, I mean, I think that we might have what it takes here. A little bit less of a spin out there. 
70. All right, that didn't seem to matter, but the little bit of a spin out might have been the exact same as not, because I had to let go to stop spinning out, which is not the plan. The less we uh, get our tires off the ground, though, the faster we'll be going here. And then we slow down a little bit. This guy's in our way. Oh, but he barely slows us down. We bump him. Okay, we weren't going 130 when we came around this corner now, though. Don't break in front of me. You're helping me turn. <laughs> Okay, we were doing a little better last time. No, the, the sliding. But look at this, we are actually getting a much faster time here. All right. We can go for first place. Okay, this the new goal right now is first place in this. If we get that, I'm calling it a victory. Look at how fast we're coming around this corner. Great. We just coasted a bit. Pump the brakes. Yeah, yeah. Pump the brakes, pump the brakes. There we go. It's okay. Pump the brakes, pump the brakes. Pump the brakes. Who cares? Who cares? We just gotta catch that guy. I gotta figure out that one corner. I might just drive around off screen in the city, taking that corner as fast as I can until I figure out how not to hit that wall. We did it the one time and then I stopped being able to do it suddenly. That was much worse. Come on! so much speed when you touch that wall. Third place again. Ugh. That first lap was so good. We were so close to the first place guy. Alright, next time nuts to this race, we're gonna head to uh, the mail guy that said he had a mission for us if we got third place in this race, which we did. So, next time, mail deliveries. Pizza time. <laughs>